Hello beautiful. I got a little channel message today and it is I still seen for the first time because I see myself. This is a channel message. It's a short one, but it's very potent and powerful. And it's for anyone that has lived their lives feeling under celebrated, undervalued, unappreciated by everyone around them. It's mostly because you have not been appreciating or valuing or celebrating yourself. People take cues from you. When you see yourself, when you value yourself, other people see you and value you in a similar light as well. If you choose to undersell yourself or kind of talk down, denigrate yourself, people will take cues from you and they will start to treat you that way as well. And obviously not everyone is gonna treat you that way just because you treat yourself that way, but because some people are just amazing and they're always gonna be amazing no matter how you treat yourself. But the point is, there are a lot of people who are watching you. Emotionally, they're sensing the way that you carry yourself. Thank you, Spirit. The way that you move through life and they are witnessing what they, you know, they are witnessing you treating yourself with less care than you deserve and they're taking it as a cue, thank you spirit, not only to treat you that way, but to treat themselves that way. It's um, this element of other people watching for permission of how to act, how to respond in a situation. They feel like they are gathering information and storing it up for later use. And yeah, thank you spirit. People are watching the way that we treat ourselves and each other as cues for how they want to treat themselves and the people around them. So always treat yourself with grace and love and compassion and always treat others with the same. Um, my, this is my baby. Bitch, my baby. He is the sweetest. Yes. Bitch, my baby. Okay. Oh, so enjoy the message for today. Go out and treat yourself amazing. Do not skimp on the details and don't um, talk down about yourself. Don't be self-deprecating. I know a lot of you can, it's a coping mechanism to crack jokes. I, trust me, I've done it. Well, I did it my whole life up until recently. Yeah, thank you, Spirit. There's a very real reason why people do it and I'm not trying to take away from that. I'm just trying to say that there are other ways to live and you don't have to tear yourself down just to make other people feel comfortable. Thank you, Spirit, because that's mostly what it is. You might not know that. You might not realize it. But that's actually what you're doing. You're placating. You're placating uh, yourself, or I'm sorry, you're placating others <laughs> to make yourself feel more comfortable as well. It kind of goes both ways. You're not just doing it for their comfort level. You're doing it for your own because by playing smaller, you feel um, safe. Thank you, Spirit. You feel safe because you were taught through life and circumstances that it wasn't safe to be yourself so when, or to be your full, big self. So when you squash yourself down into a smaller size, you're palatable for everyone. Palatable for everyone. It's not real. You, you are, but it's because you're putting yourself in a tiny little box and you deserve a lot more than that. So treat yourself with care and respect and Go out and be courageous and loving yourself. Thank you, Spirit, so you can set an example for everyone around you because you are amazing and you deserve it, okay? I love you.